I don't need your permission. This is a this is a one party consent state. I'll have you know. This is a one party consent state. I don't give a fuck what you have to say. I saw so that vicious stick wiggle, my man. With the killer has iron grasp. No, God damn it. No, let me out. Let me out. Ooh, okay. Uh, 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 new dailies. Uh. I had to move, finally, the last, the last update that Twitch got, that was probably like a couple weeks ago, finally gave you the ability to move the stream bar. Fucking finally. Like, holy shit. I know. Just the... Fucking boring. Bro, enough. <laughs> this this isn't a mashing game. <laughs> All right, this isn't fucking Smash. This isn't MK, and you're not playing. You're not playing DBZ. This is DBD. All right. Dude, cut it the fuck out. <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh, God. Well, legit, legit's dead. Rip legit. Fucking no mither. <laughs> it's Freddy. Hey, look at that legit. You might not be dead after all. Yeah, it's Freddy. I wasn't even fully asleep yet, and he tried to fucking hit me. Uh, uh. Ah! That hit? Really? Wow, okay. Oh, nice, nice lag. Nice lag. Oh, this is gonna be a good one. He straight up hit me through the pallet. I dropped the pallet on him, and it still hit me. Uh, this is gonna be good. That is possible, but it's also lag. I love that I fucked up my audio settings by playing different games, and now I'm just like, God damn it, I can't... <laughs> like, my balance between chat and gameplay... Yeah, my b balance between chat and gameplay is all distorted now. Is it... Which one of you guys is... is oh, it's legit. I can see legit's limping ass going towards me. <laughs> see how they two try and gen rush. Bro, yeah, just grab me. It's Freddy. He can't do anything. He can't stop you. I don't even worry about it.
Yeah. Yeah. Sorry, Freddy. You need a fit. I need a fit. Oh, God. I don't know this. I don't know where the pallets are on this map. I haven't had any time to move around. He's gonna be hooked to watch him just farm me. It's gonna be a great first game. Oh, uh, right back up on this hook. Just. Just perfect. Hey, can you two guys get your asses over here so me and legit can not get harmed? Also, goddamn it, Jake. Why'd you have to bring no mither? <laughs> yeah. Permanently broken the whole game. Fucking A+. Plus. Oh, I'm gonna get fucking farmed by a Freddy. Jesus Christ. Fucking hell, man. Get off my dick, Fred. Oh, this lag is really good, too. I have no dead heart. I have, I have none of that shit to counter him, either. He's gonna get me, but at least if maybe, maybe I can, I can make him waste enough time. Oh, come on! <laughs> this lag! Oh, it's so bad. Oh my god. This dude is hitting me from a fucking mile and a half away, and he's taking, he's gonna base on me too. What a fucking asshole. Holy shit. Dude, oh my god. I just got fucking farmed. I got a, no ability to fucking counter him. I got no flashlight, I got nothing. And this dude's ping has to be like 400. He's hitting me like, like I'm not even in his red stain and he's hitting me. Like, fix your connection, kid. Holy shit. Ugh, so good. Let's let's see all 6,000 blood points there in that game with the D-pip. And I lose my tool. I literally didn't get to do anything. I touched a fucking gen, and then he just fucking stayed on my asshole the whole game. That's all that happened. I touched a generator, and then he just fucking tunneled me the full fucking game. At least you guys were able to get four gens done before I got killed. Yeah, just do that, ninja. He has, he's fucking trash, but careful. He'll hit you, even if he's not within range. He doesn't have to actually be able to physically touch you to hit you because his fucking lag is so bad. What did I tell you? This kid is a lag monster. All I want to do is sabotage hooks. And we're not we're not about to lose to Freddy, the fucking trashest killer in the game. Like let's let's not lose to to Freddy. I mean I got fucking tunneled before Jens got done. Fine. Okay. Unless he's fucking popped no ad. Why is what? Yeah, I was like, you're not, you're not even fully really asleep, and you just dead hearted into a pallet. Uh, and now it's up to Randy, who's at least a second to see. Oh no, Mither.
course I, I of course I get tunneled by a Freddy first game on stream. Just <laughs> fucking F tier killer just walking me down the full game. And he he's probably got the add-ons which give us less skill checks too, because he like I barely got any skill checks. <laughs> I think this is gonna be Jake's first. Yeah. He's come. He's just right there. You guys should just leave. Fuck him. Like, you got an injured guy and someone run fucking no either. Like, what? Is what did you expect? Yeah, you have both both been hooked twice before they do. I think that got would have gone way different had I not immediately been tunneled. <laughs> and it would just get that fucking go back. <laughs> I know it's an accident, but like dude, it's like the worst person to be. <laughs> just permanently fucking dead. At 6,000 points, I was just fucking focused so hard, man. Yeah, but nobody. The thing is, is like. The killer knows you have it. He can see you have no mither. So he, they're not, like. Yeah, you're not gonna. They're not gonna leave you on the ground once they know you have it. You know? It, it, I mean. There's just a much better version of that perk called Unbreakable, where it only you can only revive yourself once, but the killer has no idea, and you're not you know permanently injured the entire game. <laughs> no, my there is an absolute fucking joke of a perk. It's it's there for meme builds. It's there for people who want to troll the killer. <laughs> just be like, you can't hit me. Yeah, like, it's because you're in low enough ranks. Once you start ranking up and whatnot, like, you get, because... Okay, shut the fuck up. But, no, like, low-level killers are straight boosted, and they don't, like, they don't know what to fucking do. But once you start getting up to, like, I'd say, like, 14, 15, that area, uh, the people who are... Who are like rank one and stuff when they get their ranks reset it puts them down to like 12. so that area is full of dudes who are like actually fucking top tier but their ranks get reset because it it resets rank every once in a while so when their ranks get reset that's where they're sitting at yeah you'll just go fucking at you coward Got six thousand fucking points tunneled by Freddy. Jesus Christ! And I was fucking farmed too, cause like the Randy pulled me off the fucking hook. I think what the first time or the second time? No, the second time, right? And like Freddy was right there, so I get pulled off the hook immediately, put to sleep, and then I gotta like pallet fucking loop him. I couldn't get to any other part of the map either. It was just so bullshit, and that lag was just just. Is perfect. That whole hitting you through pallets and shit. Like, ah, oh, yeah, ah, oh, yeah, that's how I like it. You know, like that, daddy hit me through the fucking pallet. Uh. You get ready up legit or? Ow. Hey, how, how about you go spend it all on David so you can get fucking no mither so you can put it on all your other characters? 
Yeah. Why, Attic, did you think about readying up? <laughs> I was gonna say, like, once we get into a lobby, you're still gonna have, like, a... F you're still gonna have, like, a full nine minutes once we get into the lobby to fucking <laughs> do all your shit. You know how this game is? Fucking boosted. Boosted killers over Alright, let's let's see if we can do better <laughs> this time. <laughs> let's let's see if we can not get tunneled by a Freddy. Mm-hmm. And there's only one of us in this party who had the fucking killer out of the full game. <laughs> I, I didn't even get to touch a gen, dude. I did one gen for, like, 30%, and then he showed up and just chased me the whole fucking game. Like, I didn't even have an option to do anything else. All I want to do is destroy two hooks so that I could be a toxic survivor. <laughs> Yeah, yeet. <laughs> He's on me for sure, legit gets hit. <laughs> the, uh, the HUD down in the bottom left has determined that was a lie. However, I am cleansing a dull totem, so that's just reducing our chances of Noed proccing, because, as you know, all killers love fucking Noed. <laughs> Rip. Yeah, you you got a pallet loop if you're gonna be, like, getting chased and shit pretty much the whole time. Like, you, you just have to loop them around pallets. I'm gonna see how many hooks I can destroy, because I brought a toolbox. And it has surprisingly quite a few charges. I want to see if I can get rid of all the hooks that aren't the basement. <laughs> Just to be an absolute fucking douche. Well, yeah, I mean, that's what happens when you get farmed. Somebody puts you on the hook, they take you off, and then just right in front of the killer, it's like, oh. Yeah, you're going back on the hook.
Is he still on you or is... Yeah, well, you're not getting this hook, nerd. Try and body block him. Oh, Nova says, fuck you, nerd. Yeah, pretty much. Do you have self heal legit? Or... No? Oh, shit. Yeah, if he's just gonna tunnel you, we gotta fucking gen rush. Maybe we have no other options. Oh, come on. Is this is gonna be a third hook, right? What a bitch, man. I'm telling you, boosted survivors fucking farming you. Oh, Freddy's still right there. Let's just put, let's take you off the hook so we can put you right back on the hook. Yeah, I know. Uh, but just try and body block, you know, do the best you can. I'm like 95 on this gen. So. Yeah, but you can hear him. It's the same thing as like playing against a Huntress, where like their terror radius is a lot bigger because it's the song instead. Uh, there's one near Killer Shack. I'm working on another one. It's like cross map. He's on me. Or at least he's near me. I gotta try and find a pallet because he's put me to sleep. <laughs> what? Oh my god. Legit, please tell me you saw that. Please tell me you saw that. Where? Where are the pallets, my guys? Yeah, I was gonna say though, like, have all the fucking pallets been used? Nope. Thanks, bro. Right back to sleep. Look at this guy. Look at this dude. This is the dude that fucking downs me? Like, come on. I've broken so many hooks and somehow they're back. I don't I don't know how the hooks work though. 
I think they return like every like 30 seconds if you break too many or something, but like I've fucked up all his hooks. Look at this dude. There's like no pallets on this map at all, or they've all been used and broken because I couldn't find a, like that was the only fucking pallet I found this entire time. Like I'll hold aggro. I'm fine with that. I'm fine with like keeping. Is he gonna face camp me? I mean, you can just take me off the hook as long as you're not asleep, but and he can't do anything. So yeah, he, he literally can't. And that's why Freddy's trash. He literally can't stop you from just saving me. <laughs> Respects the palette, all right. He's mind gaming himself here. <laughs> no, David! Oh my God. Fuck you, dude. You, you're actually a you fucking idiot. Oh my god. Literally, the, the David, I was running circles around the Freddy, the David just stood in the front of the pallet and he back. Like, fuck that guy, dude. If he gets hooked, you can leave him. Fuck him, man. What? What a fucking asshole. Survivors helping killers and shit. What do you go to, Ninja? Howard? Oh. It's fucking David, dude. Nova, I did say David, that's your name? Yeah, no, that's the name of the survivor. That kill dog is playing. Fucking absolute fucking asshole. Maybe, I don't know. As much as he's an idiot and an asshole, still gonna try to save him because fuck this Freddy. Wake my ass up. Fuck this bullshit. <laughs> killed, uh, you got killed out with borrowed time. Or no, he hit my borrowed time. <sighs> this is gonna be third hook for him, so he's fucking dead. Honestly, this is, this is fucking just. Do the hooks restore? Yeah, after a certain amount of time. Three minutes, they respawn. I'm doing a uh, gen that's near Killer Shack. It's at zero, so expect nothing. It's really our only fucking shot, is to try and split them. How many hooks do you have? Zero? Yeah. I've been hooked twice. The, yeah, the only reason I'm, I'm dismantling the hooks, Nova, is for uh, daily. Normally I don't even bother, because like, it is what it is. If you get down, you get down.
I'm at like 50 on this one, so. Like 80. Fuck, is he just gonna leave you? He's going for the hook. Okay, that's good. Fuck, both those exits are really close together. Is he is he just gonna camp? Or See what happens. You want me to try and get you or leave? It's up to you. <sighs> yeah. I'm gonna go I'm gonna get the other exit gate open too, because it's closer. Yeah, we literally faced the Legion the other day. <laughs> that. Alright, I'm gonna open this door and then I guess come get you. And then fuck it. Like you said, I can take a hit. I'll just attempt the body block then. Mm hmm. Plus, I got borrowed time, so fuck him. <laughs> go to your right, go to your right, go to your right. Ah. Sit to your right, man. Yeah, he flanked you. You can see his red stain. It's super easy. Yeah, he res he he, res he respects pallets. He doesn't run into him. He stops. He he checks. Dude, I I broke like six fucking hooks that game. <laughs> Yeah, one bar times great, two, you made like several mistakes and it saved you. Because I was like, go right, go right, which is where I was running and I was going to cut him off. Because if you had banked hard right and gone around the building, I could have gotten in front of him. But you continued going straight. You dropped the pallet and then you went left. And then you went left when you didn't, because you didn't see his, uh, his like vision. But, like, I maxed out on boldness, so that's cool. Because <laughs> I just destroyed so many hooks that game. <laughs> destroyed so many hooks. I cleansed, like, three totems. Yeah, no, he wasn't... Like, if he knew what he was doing, he would have been looking for me, not waiting for me to open both exit gates, and then camping you, because, like, uh, hey, dude, just so you know, you have to put me to sleep. You can't stop me from taking him off the hook. Like, he, he literally couldn't stop the unhook. And then he's like, oh, I'm going to get him anyway. Legit, whatever that is, is really loud. Like, I don't know what the, the, the plan was there. <sighs> that was fucking hag shit.
Usenatham invites. Eh, fuck it, why not? Yeah, no. Uh, I don't know how familiar you are with this game, Nova. Uh, but, yeah. Freddy is the worst killer. And dying to him is just pathetic. Like, like... I I'm sure you saw how I just walked up to the hook, took Ninja off, and we left. Yeah, that doesn't happen with other killers. <laughs> Freddy's the only one that you can bully like that. Where you're just like, hmm, I don't think you will get me. <laughs> like... Peace, bruh. Not happening, bruh. I'm pretty familiar with the game, at least seeing it. Okay, cool. Yeah. No, when, when, once those exit gates are open, it's it, it's pretty hard to to stop people from kind of doing what they want. Unless you have like no ad, which fucking every noob killer runs no ad. That being said, I also like Noed. Because <laughs> Noed is like, it's just the fucking best, dude. It's like, oh, the survivors are about to escape. Now they're not. Oh, yeah, look at that 300 ping. Oh, look at that fucking 600 ping killer. Yeah. Oh, that's what I like to see. Fucking bullshit. Didn't know Fred that Freddy was a killer till now, though. Yeah. Yo, there's a lot of movie tie-ins. There's Leatherface, there's Michael Myers, there's Freddy Krueger. Uh, they're adding Ghostface soon from Scream. Quite a few tie-ins. The only one that's probably not never going to be in the game is Jason. Because, like, the asymmetric survival multiplayer game with Jason is literally Jason's game. It's the Friday the 13th one. Uh, and this game has pretty... This game pretty much has its own version of Jason, which is, like, the trapper. Which was supposed because they didn't know how popular this was gonna be, so they didn't know they were gonna get movie characters. So like, the hillbilly is Leatherface pretty much, and then uh, the trapper is Jason. Like they didn't expect to get Leatherface in the game. Three hundred ping is mega oof. Oh yeah, now those like half of the ping in this game is just like kind of happens. Like, there's just some dodgy hit reg, like, for sure. Like, that's just how it is. And it's fine most of the time. 
But, like, when you couple the dodgy hit reg with massive ping, like, they don't even have to be close to you to hit you. Like, the, I think the most ridiculous example is the Huntress. She can throw axes at people. Uh, those axes hitboxes are wild. <laughs> like, they vary from, like, exactly the axe to, like, three to four feet around the axe. <laughs> Yeah, it literally went through legit to hit me. Ah, uh, it's Myers. He's right by us. Yeah, he's gonna be stalking. He's gonna he's gonna be stalking around. I'm just gonna go look for fucking hexes. Because that's what I do. Come on! I got him with the piece of wood. There's one. And he's running at least one hex. Right, wait, oh no, it was, the <laughs> it was the fire next to the hex that made it look, that made it look like it was fucking on. That's good. He is just hardcore stalking the David. Get far, nerd. Yeah, that's what happens when you don't play with a full team. Well, there's level two. Uh, yeah. <laughs> All right, that one was on me. I cornered myself. Count it like the count. One hook. <laughs> Two hooks. <laughs> All right, they're both working on gens, and I'll come get you. Unless he's on me. On me, boys. Unless I've lost him that easy. I did. Literally just crouched in the corn. And now the fucking other Claudette's coming to get you. They're, they all move over this way. Like, they all just follow us. Like, my god. Like, stop copies me, man. Just be your own person for once. Fuck, is he? Thought he was on that David, but apparently not. I wanted to check the fucking fallen silo. <laughs> Nova says three hooks. Ah, ah, ah. Yeah. Also, there's another totem over there, so I'll grab that once I'm done with this gen. Oh, David. Oi, David. I'll heal you. That's botany knowledge right there, boy. Hey, there you are, legit. You're right in front of me. The 
Dave's in right here is almost done. Oh. That's neat, the David was on it. Don't want to check out this. Well, there's the chest I was gonna. Oh! Hey! Purple med kit in there, I'll take that. For fucking sure. Or shirzies. I want to check this for that chest, and I also want to check for totems. There do not seem to be any. I think I've got three totems down. At least two. Minimum two. I think I got three. I don't know what the other guys have done, but I really don't want to get no head. There is an active totem, finally. Oh, he. This might be uh. Devour. Did it say devour hope when he hit you? Or was he in was he in level three? Because if he's chasing you with the uh, Halloween music and he's got his dagger down, he, like he. So the way he works is he starts at level one where he's slow and has a super small terror radius. He charges up to level two and he gets a little bit quicker and his terror radius gets bigger. And then once he's in level three, he can one shot and he moves faster, but it's only for a limited time. That was your third hook. Rip. Bro, what? I was fucking behind him. That hitbox. <laughs> Fuck out of my face with that one, dude. <laughs> Holy shit. That hitbox. He would hurry the fuck up because Myers is just gonna fucking face camp me. The guy left, dude. Oh my god, I fucking love surviving with randoms. I'd rather I'd rather attempt escape than rely on this fucking dude. I'll, I'll take my four percent chance of escape over relying on this asshole. Dude, he's gone. Come get me, you fucking boosted Claudette. Here we go, we're gone, see? See? Out of here. Easy, GG. See? Easy. <laughs> just, like, I'm like, come on, like, that was my first hug. 
he hadn't like he I'd been avoiding him the whole game and then the second he gets on me I can only find one pallet like that's my least favorite part about playing with other people is like they use those pallets like religiously that's fine uh, what dude I fuck <sighs> didn't even pit what the fuck man because I didn't uh, it's probably because I didn't work on any gens yeah Which is horseshit, because I fucking... I destroyed totems, and I was working on other stuff, but whatever. Yeah, Devour. That's why he downed you that first time, probably. Our hope. And, that, and that's why you search for totems right there. Devour hope. That is... <laughs> that and no ed are the reasons you fucking search for totems. And anybody who doesn't search for totems is a fucking idiot. Because <laughs> that shit important. Yeah, and I and and it's I'm even happier that I got out because I got goofed by that fucking hitbox. Like holy shit, man. Like when he hit me, I was like maybe 12 feet away from him. Like it like it was one of those disgusting hitboxes where it was like, "Oh, oh really? Oh, okay." Like, like that was bad. <laughs> I love that this community like treats Nia as one of the killers. It's like Nia is actually a killer because people who usually play Nia are running like some super toxic shit. They're running like dead hard, decisive strike, <laughs> balance landing and live and adrenaline and like all that stuff. Just just the fucking annoying perks. And it's just like they just run killers around the map constantly. Like yeah, I just, I couldn't find a pallet. Like, that's the thing. Is like, you can keep a killer on a pallet for a while, and, like, but eventually, eventually they'll figure out how to counter it, or they'll break it or something. You'll be forced to drop it. One of those. Hey, bloody streamers. That's nice of them. That, that's a nice guy for using those. But, uh, like, once you, once that pallet's out of commission, you gotta go to the next one. It's like I start running from the pallet I'm at, and I'm just like, all the other locations where there should be a pallet, there are not. There's not a pallet. <laughs> like, I can even work with a pallet that's already been dropped, but, like, if there's no nothing there, like... Uh, <laughs> I didn't use an offering. Fuck me. <laughs> I always forget. 
Because, like, if it's not, like, a good offering, I forget to use it. Because I'm always just like, oh, those piece of shit brown ones? Yeah, I don't need that. But I do. I do need those piece of shit brown ones. Yeah. Because you, you don't need to. I mean, you should be using one every game. Because, statistically speaking, with the points you earn from that game, you'll earn back at least one offering from the blood web. So... I think I've only played this map like twice. So. Oh, found you. Oh, we're all here. Excellent. And so is Killer Shack. Is basement Killer Shack? Uh, it is a Huntress. Basement isn't Killer Shack. So careful. Whoa! Nope. Oh, she's using the busted shit. Fuck you, bitch. Yeah, this, this is a GG boy. She's using an iridescent fucking head. Yeah, we're fucking done. Ugh, good luck. Good fucking luck. For any of you that don't know, the Iridescent Head is the extremely rare Huntress add-on, which allows her to fucking one-shot with her throwing axes. He tried. She's also got territorial imperative. I'm fucking dead, don't even bother. Oh yeah, yeah, find hatch, bro. She's got territorial imperative and fucking iridescent head. Like, it, that's GG. Don't even bother. Don't even fucking bother. <laughs> <laughs> That's GG right there. Yeah, I, I should have we, we should have known that she had uh she's got the skin. She's got the legendary huntress skin. Yeah. Just, just start. See this is what I'm talking about when when rank one killers get rank reset and they're if they're in like the tens and shit. It's like I I shouldn't be allowed to play with you. Like this is horseshit. Like, yeah. All we can hope is we die so fast she knee pips. <laughs> we don't give her enough points, boys. Make her deep pip. Now, what these two should do to be gentlemanly is fucking just kill themselves, but they're not going to. Bayonets, or Baya. Well, it's not going to spawn until you're the last one left. It does? It only spawns during, like, certain, like... I think it spawns if, like, two gens are left, or... Like, opening requirements have to be either all the gens are... Like, you have to be the last one left on the map for it to open. But I think it's, like... A certain amount of gens have to be done, or a certain amount of people have to be dead before it spawns. I would not be around here. Because she is. Iridescent head. Iridescent head. She might be trying to give you hat. No? That's weird. I thought she would have taken you to the basement. Like, hey dude, thanks for being an- oh, she knew where the hatch was too, excellent. Hey dude, thanks for being an absolute fucking cunt. Coming into a rank fucking, like, 12 game with- Yeah, they do. 
Look at that. Yep, infantry belt and the iridescent head. Uh, territorial impair. Oh, she was going for the achievement. Because she was only using the three Huntress perks. She was trying to get Adept Huntress, which we probably just gave her. <clears throat> Rank 15, my ass, dude. Rank 15, my fucking ass. Wow, so fucking epic. It doubled my it doubled my fucking 969 blood points. Jesus fuck. Yeah, uh that that's safe to say that's a deep hit. Safe to say. I just messaged him, like, I know you're going for the achievement, but still, bro, <laughs> like, fucking infantry belt and an iridescent head, like, at rank 15, what are you doing here, you're not rank 15, get the fuck out. Oh uh, yeah, that was just, that was just a fuck, fucked up game, man. Like, we had a rank 17 in our game, too. <laughs> like, what, what is he supposed to do against that? Like, I couldn't even do anything against that. Like, come on. I don't even know what to use for my fourth perk. Like, I don't like anything. Like, I like self-care, borrowed time, and bonding knowledge. Those are all great, but like, my fourth perk, I'm just like, I don't know what to fucking use. Like, I really don't like any of the ones that I have. Like, none of them jump out at me, you know? I guess I'm just gonna run, we'll make it for a little bit.
Man. That guy can clean us up real fast, but he can't fucking spell. Yeah, fuck it. He's like, I, he literally had the balls to say I never use her though. Like, dude, you have her skin and you have an iridescent head. Like, to get very rare add-ons, you have to be like at least level 30 through your blood web. Like, you have to be at least 30 before very rare is even start showing up in your fucking blood web. You've used her, like, <laughs> what you now? clearly use her. You, f you fucking liar. Yeah, that's like trappers like me who run Bloody Coil and Honing Stone. It's just like, it's, it's not, it's not fun to fight you. It's not fun. Like, if you see a bear trap, your options are either get injured or leave it alone and try not to run into it later which will instant down you. Like, again, forgot to use a fucking offering. I think it should just auto use one every game. Like, like it should be a setting. Just like you use, like if I don't pick an offering, just use one of the blood point ones. Just use, just use one of them. <laughs> I, d I don't, just, yeah, like I, f I forgot, okay? The first thing out of my mind isn't 3% more blood points in one category. <laughs> like, just use it. it. It's so minimal. It's like 50% more blood points in one category. Like, the only ones that fucking matter are the ones that are double blood points in all categories. Those are great. All the other ones can fuck off. They can fuck right off. Oh, man. Bethesda is currently streaming Fallout 76 on their official account to less than 2,000 people. Oof. Man, did you... Did you see any of the Bethesda E3 press conference? Okay. The killer is already by me? Fucking seriously? Uh, that press conference is... Is it a trap? I can't tell who it is. I think it's Trapper. Yeah, it's Trapper. Uh, that press conference takes place on another fucking planet. It is so disconnected with the reality of that game. Where the fuck is this dude? This dude is just like sprinting around the map. That's already one gen down. Uh, like, it takes place in a different fucking reality. Like, they come out on stage and they're just like, it's Fallout 76, is pretty great, huh? And it's like, are you, are you fucking with me? Like, it feels like you're watching like, uh, fuck it, I hit that great skill check. Okay. Oh, oh, I'm gonna get fucking going. Dude, oh my god, the lag in this... <laughs> yeah, this is okay. This is gonna be my last one. Now I'm gonna hop on over to something else. Cause, uh, like, holy fucking shit. Of course, you got iron, iron grass trapper with a sloppy butcher, too. So you got hemorrhage and mangled. It's not even the killer's fault. It's not even his fault. But, like,. It's, it's really the game. Like, I think it's because I'm streaming. Like, I think really streaming is tanking. Because, like, 
I get some bad shit sometimes. Like, don't get me wrong. I, like... I get some bad fucking shit sometimes. But this is just, like, extra. That move. Yeah. Plus he's hitting with Mangled too, so it's slowing our healing by another 20%. Which Sloppy Butcher's a decent perk, bro. For for a new perk, it's pretty it's pretty all right. Wow, that finished on my end. That's why I started moving, and then it just unfinished. Yep, happens. I mean, it's not the killer, like, it's not the killer's fault. Like, I'm not gonna be mad at the killer for the way that this game is going, but, like... Fuck! <laughs> yeah, you know, fuck this. He's also got, probably, like, setting tools. Or, no, he's got the springs. Got upgraded springs because it's increased time to disarm. Probably trapped the window because, like, no. Everybody, that, that's like what you do as trapper. You trap the fucking window. I'm coming back over this way. Oh, it's been sabotaged. Oh. <sighs> oh, Ash. probably gonna come back over this way because they just disarmed one of his fucking traps. And I'm currently sabotaging it. Fuck, dude, what? Didn't expect him to fucking come around that way, man.
Mind game, bitch. No. I juked his ass. Now I gotta go through the painful self heal with hammer or with the mangled status effect. So it's 20% slower. The basement's not a killer shack, and the pallet's still here, so I can loop him here for a while if I have to. I'm gonna start working on the gen that's here. That guy got it down really fast, didn't he? Is that one hit? Those are the good ones. Is he on you? I'm assuming he's gonna be on you. I'm gonna go try and get our buddy. He's coming back. No, you idiot! Ugh. Fucking moron, dude. Let me body block for you. Like... Dude, oh my god, I fucking love playing with survivors. This is fucking smart, man. Survivors who are like, you know what? Instead of letting me body block for you, I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna. Gonna not. We're gonna step in some fucking random ass bear trap, my man. Dude, uh, I love how he didn't even lunge. Oh, that's my favorite. Oh, that's my favorite. How he didn't even lunge. Iron grass trapper. Mm. Oh, and this hook is back, even though I demoed it. Fucking sexy. Yeah. I was gonna fucking tank a hit for that guy so he could get away, but instead of following me, he decided to break off as an own and try and 360 the fucking trapper. Like, I, I, I just don't. I don't get it. That was ballsy. You just dead hard on that. Nice. Hit that dead hard, bro. Yeah, there's there's like nothing on this side of the map. It's all been used. already got like level fucking three bloodlust dude there's like how does he still have bloodlust he should have lost his bloodlust when you got away and now i'm gonna get my fucking third hook oh, this oh yeah just run into that fucking bear trap you fucking <laughs> oh man i love playing without a full team it's so much fun this game is so much fun without a full team you just get fucking shit on. Like, the killer just rips your fucking hat off and shits down your neck when you don't have a full team. Because you just get these fucking absolute mongoloid survivors who have no idea what to fucking do. Like... Uh. Uh. Please, please tell me that guy was... 14... Okay, so our guys were 14 and 15. Deja vu, fucking whatever. Calm spirit. Also, whatever. He had saboteur, which is pretty good. And then iron, like, 
Yeah, the killer wasn't even that good, dude. I'm telling you. Like, all he had was Iron Grass and Sloppy Butcher level 1. Like, we were way more stacked than him, but these fucking two absolute idiots. He even, dude, this guy even had Metal of Man and he couldn't get away. What the fuck is this game? Holy shit. What? Like, I'm not supposed to be running the killer around and I had 6,500 boldness <laughs> as a Claudette. Like, come on. Huh. Uh. Oh, what's going on, gun dude? Sorry, I didn't notice you because I've been having a crisis. Uh, DVD, woo. Eh, it's okay, I guess. I like the game. I've never played it, but I've watched it, though. It's cool. Wow, every one of his buddies are fucking retards except for that one guy. <laughs> Yeah, you know, you mean the dude who's, who I have the same gamer tag or who I'm in a clan with? <laughs> that guy? Yeah, that guy's alright. All these other fuckers. All these other. Fucker. You fucker. Why you a girl? Uh, because every. So, there's a bunch of different survivors. And they all start with different perks. So the way it works is she's got teachable perks, right? So once you hit level, uh, I think it's 30, right? 30, 35, and then 40. You can learn those teachable perks and you can unlock them as teachable so that you can teach them to other survivors. Uh, Claudette has one of the best teachable perks that she starts with, which is self-care. Which allows you to heal yourself without a med kit. So that's why I'm playing her. Is to get her up to at least 40 so that I can get self-care for everybody else. Self-care is real. Oh yeah, I'm immediately... Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm switching. I'm going Claudette and then I'm going David. Because David's got Dead Hard, which is like... Dead Hard is an ability where you can just press a button and you basically get iframes for like a dash forward. So, yeah, it was pretty good. Like, I got fucked over. I could have kept him going. Oh, I thought you were horny for her. No, uh, who's the hottest fucking? Probably Kate. Probably Kate's probably like the hottest. I'd say she's got she's like that kind of like heavy look all tatted and shit uh, No, man. Yeah, I, I could have kept him going around that longer if he didn't have bloodlust already But the thing was is is he is he was in the chase with you and he got up to bloodlust level one and then Immediately started the chase with me and got bloodlust level two So he was chasing me around with bloodlust level two. I couldn't loop him. I'm like he's too fast He's too fast. I can't loop him I should I should have stayed back a bit so that I could have broken his bloodlust and then and then looped him around that. I was just trying to give the fucking other guy a chance to do gens, but like as what it is what it is. Sometimes that's how it goes, <laughs> especially when you got Randy's. Sometimes that's just how it fucking goes. Huh. So you want to do another one? <laughs> uh, or is that it for you? I did. I think. Oh, I, I think I did. Yeah, I got like 16. But you should play Skyrim next. Killed by the Giants. Uh, Skyrim is definitely on the list. Uh, but I'm also playing The Witcher currently. Well. I, I, I know a guy who mods, <laughs> but uh, no, if uh, I, I want to finish The Witcher first, so Skyrim will definitely be on there. Uh, I don't think anytime soon though, because I haven't been playing The Witcher very much. And if you haven't played The Witcher 3, I'll let you in on a little secret. It's long as fuck. Uh, so it's definitely gonna be a little while before Skyrim happens, but it is definitely on there. So it's something to look forward to. The Witcher 3, it's like 300 hours. It's 300 hours if you're like absolute completionist. But like, if you're, you know, just playing the game, like you're doing side missions, you're doing the main missions, you're doing a little bit of leveling up, you're, you're kind of like completing the game, 
like just doing the next step. It's like a hundred hours. Cause I also have both DLCs and like Heart of Stone is like 15 hours. And then Blood and Wine is like 30 fucking hours. <laughs> Blood and Wine as a DLC is like a full fucking video game. It's so long. There's so much to do in Blood and Wine. Well, you could do The Witcher 1 and 2. <laughs> That's not going to happen. Uh, I appreciate I appreciate the, uh, the suggestion, but uh, those two games are absolute... Those two games have fantastic stories. However, when it comes to the controls, they are so impossibly dated. Those games feel like shit. They're absolute trash fires to play. And I'm not going to fucking put myself through that. I, I, I will occasionally do hard things on this channel. I played through fucking Dead Money in Fallout New Vegas. By God, I did it. It's not on fucking VOD, because I wasn't I didn't have my YouTube channel at the time. But I fucking did it. Nova was there, and he can vouch. I went through fucking Dead Money, and that fucking bullshit. <sighs> Fuck, dead. Fuck Dead Money. Have you ever played it legit? You ever play Fallout New Vegas? No? Okay, there's a, a fucking DLC called Dead Money where they're just like, hey, you know what would be really cool is if uh, all the enemies in this area are 10 levels higher than you and we take away all your shit. It's just like, oh, just, oh, uh, okay, all right. Oh, also, also, we, we will, I'm getting to that. Also, you have a bomb collar on that uh, will go off if it hears uh, a signal from the radios that are around. So you like your collar just randomly starts beeping sometimes and you have to find the radio signal you know either the radio or the speaker that's making the noise in a certain amount of time or you just die while you're being attacked by enemies 10 levels higher than you and you have none of your items it's fucking terrible Bet you there's a mod for Sky. Yeah, no, dude. It's fu it's ser it's seriously fucking awful. Dead money is terrible. It's not even fun. Like it's not even like oh well this is a this is a challenge. No, it's just fuck you. It's fuck you hard. It's like a Dark Souls where it's like ah, just get fuck nerd. Just bash your head into the wall until you do it. Like true story. Don't play Dead Money. Here's my last resort. Guitar Hero. Bad idea. That was a bad idea. Don't read that. <laughs> Uh, I'm, dude, I don't have, like, can I play it with a controller? Because I'm not about to go, <laughs> I'm not about to go out, I'm not about to go out and buy, I think so. Uh, I'm not about to go out and buy a, a fucking guitar, like, I'm not about to go out and buy the hardware for that. Are you going to invite me to a game, or am I switching over to kill it? Yeah, I know, but like, like a thing. <laughs> uh, yes, you can. Xbox is amazing, right? Uh. <laughs> Dude, I had Guitar Hero. I was in like sixth grade maybe, uh, and I was playing Guitar Hero Metallica, and I was playing fucking Master of Puppets on normal, and I was killing that shit. <laughs> I have no music, I have no musical talent, dude. My dad tried to teach me to play guitar like five separate times. My dad plays guitar. He tried to teach me like when I was like five, again when I was like ten, like pretty much every five years he tried. And I was like 18, 19, and maybe 17. I was, shit, I was like 16, 17. It was my junior year, fuck. Yeah, it was my junior year of high school and all my buddies were like in a, in a band, right? And they were like, oh dude, you should totally learn to play, man. It'd be so cool. I'd like hang out at their house. They'd be playing drums and guitar and shit. Like here, this is how you do it. And I'm just like, I'm holding it. And I'm just like, I, it's not there, man. Like there's something about music where you feel it. I don't have that. Like, I love music, don't get me wrong. I love, I, I enjoy singing, right? 
Lyr lyrics are great. I enjoy listening to music. I, I can feel music. I like seeing live music. I cannot play an instrument. <laughs> it is not there. <laughs> that c I do not possess the capability. Someone's had an escape cake. Yeah. There's also Clone Hero. Yeah, I've I've heard about that. I've heard about Clone Hero. But it's crazy on you. Crazy, crazy on you. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Nah, man. Like, I've always been, a, like, a decent, like, lyricist. Like, matching tone and whatnot, like, being able to, like... Like, my singing tone, like, I cannot go very high. My range is quite small, because I've never been trained, and I've never attempted to train myself. But, like, when it comes to, like, singing quickly, or memorizing lyrics, like, I can do that fairly effectively. Like, if I pick a song, and I'm like, I really like this song, I'm gonna learn it. I can learn that song in like a couple days and be able to sing it at full speed. But like, as far as like hitting the notes, I don't. <laughs> I think I need a little while for that, but uh, you ever listen to Slipknot? I'm assuming you have. You know the song, uh, Wait and Bleed? Oh, Killer's already on us, sweet. It's a hillbilly, fucking excellent. Yeah, check out the song Wait and Bleed by Slipknot. It's a great fucking song if you haven't heard it anyways, but uh, I can, I still think I can sing that at full speed. And he's pretty quick. It's not Rap God, not even close, but it's pretty quick. Fuck no, I hate Slipknot. Well, fuck you too, Gundy. <laughs> Slipknot hates you. And also Nova, Nova said, I love music. Do you play an instrument? Hell no, basically. Yeah. Fucking Slayer is the best, boy. Oh, I agree with that. I never said that Slipknot was better than Slayer. I'm not fucking retarded. <laughs> Slayer's fucking, Slayer's love, Slayer's life, bro. Slayer was my for the first fucking live music I ever saw was Slayer. I was like 13 years old and I went and saw Slayer, uh, Gojira and Forearm at the Aragon Ballroom in Chicago. I nearly missed that skill check because I was fucking thinking. Uh, yeah. I was like 13. It was my fucking freshman year of high school. And I went and saw Slayer when they were doing... I think they were on tour for... Uh... No, it wasn't Repentless. Because Repentless came out in, like, what, 2016? I don't remember what. The, oh, it was it was the first tour. It was the first like string of tours or shows they did uh, after Hanuman died. Still got the gen, nerd. He he got the hit off, but I still got the gen. It's like my dick. Oh, he he's just trying to slug everybody, isn't he? I'm injured, that guy's down. He just left that dude laying there, seriously, what the fuck? <clears throat> Are you guys going to get him? Cause I'll just keep fucking hitting gens then. Let's see what's in the basement. Let's see what goodies they, that this Billy's got for me. Uh, I've heard Slipknot is formulaic and repetitive. Uh, to that, I would say they definitely have their sound and they stick to it. Uh, they're they're trying to break that up a little bit, but I, I wouldn't say they're formulaic. 
as much because their songs definitely do have range. Um, and and I, th I think some of their songs differ quite a bit, but it, like each album has its own sound, but each... Yeah, I'm not. I'm on a totem right now and then I'm coming to get you. I'm just burning this down real quick. Uh, like, you should obviously always formulate your own opinion when it comes to music, and if you don't really, just fucking DC after one hit, dude. What a fucking... Oh, you guys are gonna get fucking mobbed. It's gonna be great. We have one gen. Um... Yeah, I mean... I don't know it's hard to say because I, I I feel personally because I'm a metal fan and I you know I'm not one of those people where it's like oh all metal is just noise uh, just so you know legit he has extremely poor turning radius when he's doing that so moving horizontally is your best bet oh okay uh, first music show I saw was the bangles I'm not sure I even know who that is but I, I will. That's that's cool. <sighs> fucking. <sighs> Holy shit! I'm just gonna fucking just teabag them. Like. This is just such, such fucking dog shit. You're on a hook, someone gets hit, fucking insta DCs. His other dude is just useless, like... <laughs> I don't wanna be a pirate. I, I like Slipknot quite a bit. Uh, I think they definitely have range in their music, but it, it is it is what it is. You know? um, sorry, I'm trying to formulate a sentence, but I'm also quite upset that just we cannot get a fucking confident team. <laughs> like we, I did one. J I, I did one gen. You guys want to take a guess at how many gens were done in total? One. <laughs> like, I, I, I ne it's never it's never directed at you. And there's the deep hip. It's never directed at you, legit. It's always directed at the fucking other two. Like just, 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 just. Uh. He, had, he had no good perks either. It Deerstalker and Tinker. I mean, Tinker is decent, which is how he knew where I was. Uh, but. Uh, yeah, it, that was just a dog shit game. Well, since you're done, I'm gonna go try my hand at some killer before I hop on Call of Duty. But, uh, go, go see if I can get a couple good killer games or if I'm just gonna get fucking bullied. If I get the full team of competent survivors that just <laughs> kick my fucking ass. Uh, I'm also... Don't make fun of me, I'm new to Huntress. I've only played a couple games with her. I don't really know how she works yet. Well, I know how she works, but I'm not very good with her yet. Uh, ba 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 ba. Yeah. So, Slim Knot. Fuck. Let me actually formulate, form a sentence here. Yeah, I can definitely see how people would consider them repetitive. Uh, a lot of their stuff sounds the same, but if it's something that you're into, uh, then you'll like it. 
it's one of those things where it's like if you like one song you'll probably like the album uh every song is different they all have you know different parts and whatnot but the their sound is very similar like if you if you didn't know Slipknot like you'd be able to hear any song and be like that's Slipknot but not be able to tell the song if you weren't really into it um so you know check them out I really like them but then again most of the music I like other people don't <laughs> so it is what it is but Wait and Bleed is Pretty good song. Spit It Out is also another really good song by them. Uh, and then Gun Dude says, well, I've seen Metallica, Slayer, The Bangles, and Nirvana. And that's all the shows I've seen. You saw Nirvana. That's fucking dope. Uh, I have seen the big four. So I saw Metallica. Uh, I saw Slayer. I saw Anthrax. And I saw Megadeth. Uh, shit. Let's list. Let's see. I don't even think I can tell you all the fucking people I've seen, but I'm going to give it a shot. I've seen Lamb of God twice. I've seen Testament twice. I've seen Exodus. I've seen Toxic Holocaust. I've seen Municipal Waste. I've seen. Uh, bah, 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 bah. Hmm. Who else? Who else have I seen? A bunch of local bands. I used to like hang out at the fucking rock club. So it's just a bunch of like shitty fucking bands from the area, but a couple of them are decent. Uh, I've seen Jungle Rot, I've seen Slipknot, I've seen yeah. Well, I saw Nirvana in '91, and I was four. <laughs> Yeah. So, technically, you were there. You just don't remember a whole lot. Oh, this is the exact same map I played on last time as Huntress. And coincidentally, that was the first time I played on that map. So, this is going to be the second time on this map. So, forgive me if I just fucking eat it. Because I don't know this map that well. Yeah, but Nirvana, Nirvana's dope, bro. Wish I could have seen Nirvana at some point. The two bands that I w have never seen and will never get to see are Nirvana and Pantera. You know, because, like, people are dead. Oh, I'm getting fucking gen rushed. Excellent. Oh! 
No, bro. Uh, mm. yeah. I'm already fucking three gens down. I'm just getting gen rush. This is gonna be a fantastic game. See, these are the competent survivors I wish I had played with. Like, they're not fantastic or anything, but they're definitely fucking able to keep themselves alive. Two gens. Stay away from me. Rescue him from right out from under my fucking nose. That kind of shit. And of course that gen's done now. Woohoo, yay. Fucking excellent. Yeah. And they got a gen in the basement still and these two gens back here. Yeah, I'm probably fucked. There's no way I'm gonna be able to keep track on him. And then the other two gens are so far away from me that... And then the insta rescue. Oh, all three of them. They just want to keep me off their friend because he's dead on hook. Which, like, whatever, fine. God, it's so much longer than I think. Whoa! The wind up on that is like fucking a week. This dude's dead. Still only have one gen to do, but... Oh, he's fucking over here like a genius. Ah! 
No. Watch, I'm fucking decisive, man. No? No decisive? That's weird. Oof. You're about to get farmed. girl and also you're going right back on the same fucking hook because I want to keep you on this side of the map if I can and you might be dead here yeah dead on hook there's two left but they still only need one gen yep and that's the gen Ooh, one of them had adrenaline too. Sorry, bro. Yeah, your other friend left you. That sucks. Uh, it was a three man. Could have been better for sure, but not terrible. Since seeing, seeing as they did those first three gens that fast, that wasn't terrible to get a three man. <coughs> uh, blah, blah, blah. Sorry. Uh, swiggity swoop. Yeah, come for that boot. I saw Slayer in 97. Nice. My axe is coming for the booty. Yeah. Swiggity swooty. My axe is coming for the booty. Uh, I've smashed 14 PS2s. <laughs> That's, what, you, what you got against the second generation of the PlayStation, my man? And then, uh, have you noticed she's humming? Yeah, that's her lullaby. Alright, that was a fairly decent game. That's hilarious. She had boil over, and you're not allowed, like, oh, increased, you know, struggling, and you're not allowed to see hooks. It's like, yeah, but when I picked her up and her boil over procced, I knew exactly where the hook was already, so. <laughs> Get fucked, nerd. Uh, Shroud, yeah. They, fucking three of them had toolboxes. No shit, those gens were done so fast. Adrenaline, urban evasion, yeah. The one who got out, of course, had adrenaline borrow time. Fucking spine show, all that good shit. All that good, good. I was mad at Crash Bandicoot. I too, my friend, was also mad at Crash Bandicoot. <laughs> we were all mad at Crash Bandicoot. You can take solace in knowing everyone at one point was fucking mad at Crash Bandicoot. Yeah, I need to get her to 15 to even unlock that fucking next perk. Awesome. Crash Bandicoot! Crash! More like... Breaking Gerbil? Well, he's a Bandicoot, mate. He's Australian. Uh. 
Oh, what now? Uh, Prestige 3, Claudette, Ash, Fangman, and Nia. Oh boy. I meant jumping gerbil. She's also ugly. What, Huntress? Bro, she's so beautiful. You're only a cannibal, bro. Like, get over your fucking bias. Right? Yes. Yeah, the two the two killers in the game that uh produce more sound than the rest are the Huntress and Freddy. Uh Huntress hums her lullaby and Freddy sings his lullaby. So that's their terror radius instead of the normal like heartbeat is their music. And it's because of their abilities. So she has a uh th since her, she has a range attack she like you need to hear from further away and then uh since freddy is invisible like the whole fucking time until he pulls you into the dream world the lullaby is the only way you know where he is in like a general sense uh so you want to molest her no i want her to molest me there's a difference Dude, this bitch is like 6'9 and packing axes. Like, who the fuck do you think's molesting her? Got fucking Shaquille O'Neal over here. Female version. I'm not gonna lie, legit. Until you, like, said something about Crash Bandicoot earlier. Totally forgot you were here. You've been so damn quiet. You've been... Okay, I was gonna say, I'm like, you've been zacking up this party. <laughs> Okay. Uh, you want to see what she has? Wink, wink. Bro, I don't care what she has. As long as she's wearing that bunny mask, I don't give a fuck. You think I didn't see you? Oh! Dead hard, that motherfucker. Dad has showed up to bully me. Oh, they're almost done with his gen too. Fucking excellent. Yeah, she wants me to chase her, but that's not gonna fucking happen, so. Go ahead, save him. I know you got but fucking borrowed time. See? Called it. Good to know, the hitboxes are really high on it. Yeah, they're just fucking gonna be doing gens and trying to bully me and shit. It's gonna be great. And he's gonna fucking dead hard the first chance he's got. Throw down every fucking power. You fucking dip? Get the fuck out of here, man. Oh! 
shit, bitch. Oh, I should have face bended her. No, nah, it's it's a prestige three Claudette and she's trying to run me. But oh man, these guys her team is not doing her any favors. They just keep failing their gen checks. But they're like all fucking nearly done with these gems, dude. They're like 99ing them. I'm getting bullied so hard here. There's Ash. Watch his fucking Metal of Man proc. Got Metal of Man and Dead Hard, so. Oh! Yeah, there's Metal of Man. That's gone now. Have fun. Hey! Uh, oh! That hit, really? Well, the job pallet's gone now. Absolutely gen though. No kills, fucking three gens done. It's fucking amazing. And they stole him again. I'm getting absolutely bullied right now. Bro, Nia, no. buddy and you're done where are gens we got one here one over there one over there Pain in my dick. Nah, bitch. What? That's so hit.
Jen, 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 fuck. She's trying to get my attention. She wants me over there so we can fuck these gens up. And there goes, <clears throat> and there goes my lullaby. They they were looking for it. They didn't want my fucking lullaby going on anymore. Cause they were just making it way too hard for them to do gens. Cool, you just give me another reason to take it. No dead hard? Surprising. First fucking hook, excellent. They're not gonna be fucking with that one, they're probably on that one. Oh, this one? Really? Huh. Of course. It's fucking clawed at. Ugh. And they're going for the Nia too. The other two are probably getting out. But they were just bullying me this whole game. That plot out is like really fucking good. They open the other door. Time because of course. Ah! Ah! Yeah, I just watch them bully me because they're all fucking like, like. See, that's that's the issue I have with the ranking in this game. Is it makes it so that like, I'm not great, right? I'm not completely retarded. But I'm not very good at this game. I've been playing for less than a week. Uh, and people who have been playing this for two years, three years now, because it came out in 2016, they get deranked and are able to play with me, and then it's that horse shit, because they all know the perfect loops, they know how to duck, play against every killer, they know exactly where to run on the map, they've all got their broken ass perks on all their characters. All of them, I guarantee you, at least, at least the Claude I was running borrowed time. Yeah, rank eight, rank seven. I guarantee you that the rank 20, like he, or the rank 15, whatever, but like, yeah, I guarantee you. Yeah, borrowed time, self care, empathy, life. Fucking. Metal of Man, decisive, sprint burst, adrenaline. Like, they're running really good shit against me, and I'm like, still learning this game. And it's like, I'm, I'm like, 
I'm not t-ball level, but I'm at like I'm like playing on a high school team, and these fucking like MLB players have like they're they're walking around in like a trench coat pretending to be an adult. Except it's like they're pretending to be high schoolers. They're like, yeah, man, like high school is like so much fun. Yeet, right, my fellow child? And they're playing on like a fucking high school team, just slamming home runs, pitching at 100 miles an hour. And it's just like, dude, I'm still like in the learning stages here. I don't want to be playing against people who have like prestige three killers running some broken ass shit. Because it's fucking annoying when all three of them get out because the Claudette runs me around the whole game and then, oh, borrowed time, <laughs> as they 99 the door. Like, what fucking asshole? Really? 99 the door? Fuck you, dude. Like, eat a dick. I'll kill you IRL. Like, <laughs> just some dumb shit. Like, I have fucking three perks and they're running all their fucking stack shit. Fuckity foogity, I'm coming to swoogity. Play Witcher next or COD, that's fine. Fist bump. Can't escape from me, mate. How do you do, fellow kid? Yeah, seriously, they're fucking Steve Buscemi. How do you do, fellow rank 15s? Like, they're fucking absolute killers over here, pretending, pretending that they're fucking novices. And they just come in and, like, stomp people. Because it's essentially smurfing. But it's not, because the game not only encourages it but allows it because it's like yeah no we're just gonna re like they do rank reset i think it's every every like two weeks or something and they knock you down 10 ranks so people who are rank one turn into rank 11s and then they're just wreaking havoc at rank 11. and i get it it's so that you can't just like get to a high rank once and then just kind of chill there but still it's it's just fucking frustrating to have to go against that. It's it's just frustrating to have to to have to verse people who are who have had so much practice. I mean, this game's been out for three years. So, you, you, and you can tell that the, the Claudette that I'm referring to, if, if you guys don't know, she had, she was covered in blood. Uh, the blood outfit is for hitting prestige three. So she's at least third prestiged on that character, if not more. And, and then running borrow time, running, running all the good stuff, running all your favorite hits, all the classics. And it's just frustrating to have to go against is all. Where it's like, and you saw how they were bullying me, like, they're just running around me pretending. The Jane, I barely, I found, like, fucking once. She was hidden the whole game. The, the Ash wasn't very good, but he still had really good perks on. I just, they farmed him that second hook. He got hooked twice really quick. Uh, the Claudette was just sneaking around. The Jane was sneaking around. The Neo wasn't very good, but, the, but again, her two teammates were fucking absolute beast so they they got her out on the borrowed time by 99ing the door and just being absolute fucking assholes about it like they're probably all laughing oh we fucking stomp this dude like yeah no shit you stomp me like i'm not on your level i'm not as good as you we shouldn't be in the same game together and it's fucking unfair that we are like, it, like those dudes who and, it, and it's not their fault it's how the matchmaking works it's the matchmaking, putting extremely experienced people in a game with, you know, me. I'm pretty fucking new to this shit. You know, I still don't know how a lot of the killers work. I still don't know what some of the survivor perks do. <laughs> so, you know, people who've been playing this shit for three years are coming up against me. I want to be like, all right, cool. Yeah, I, the game you've never played before, but I've been playing for three years. Yeah, hop on that. Let's see how you do. Like, <laughs> it's just it's fucking... Was it the ranting? <laughs> nah, man, it's good. You got work tomorrow? Alright, well. Feel better. Have fun. I'll, uh, catch you when I catch you. See ya.
Yeah, either way, I'm done with this shit for the night. I'm, uh, I am turned. I am heated. Uh, we're gonna hop on COD. We're gonna hop on World at War. Probably finish that up. Uh, Witcher, we will, we will definitely be getting back into the Witcher at some point. I assure you. At some point, we will be getting back into the Witcher. It's just, like, it's just so long that I'm not really concerned about it. Because it's not one of those games where I'm like, Alright, we can bust this out in, like, the next two. It's like, no, that's gonna be, like, 20 more streams. At least. Like, it, it's just so fucking long. So, we'll definitely be back on there. Uh, but, gonna hop on COD, probably bust that out tonight. And then we'll, we'll think about what we start doing next. Think about what we want to start, or if we want to hop back on The Witcher. Because COD shouldn't take more than a few hours. Should be like two or three hours at most. We're like, I think we're over halfway through. So I will be right back, y'all. <laughs>